In an effort to extend design analysis to plastic parts designers and mold designers, SOLIDWORKS introduces MoldFlow Express. MoldFlow Express is a wizard-based tool that answers one simple question. Will an injection molded part fill in the, given certain conditions in the injection molding process? Users are allowed to specify a single injection point where the material will fill the part during the injection molding process. To do this, users simply select the face. As they step through the wizard, they're prompted with each step or next phase. Users then choose a material. From a list of over 20 materials, users are given particular material properties important for the injection molding process. Users then can specify process conditions or accept default values and go ahead and run the analysis. Based on the given boundary conditions, MoldFlow Express will interrogate the model geometry determined based on the material, the mold temperature, and the melt temperature whether this part can be made in an injection molding process. MoldFlow Express is intended to break down the barriers between designers and manufacturing by giving users particular information based on how actual parts will react in the real-world manufacturing process. This is a truly unique capability to SOLIDWORKS users, letting them extend the capabilities of 3D design into better optimizing and understanding the manufacturing process. You see, as our analysis completes, we get a preview of how the part's going to fill based on the injection location. MoldFlow Express will provide us feedback on the results as well. As our analysis completes, you see we get a color plot. Notice we have a red stop sign in the wizard, letting us know that there's going to be a problem in the injection molding process. We can step through the time plot, and what we see is that the bottom feet of our business card holder are not going to fill. This is what we call a short shot. Now, we can click on the information button to find out what types of things we could change in order to do this. We could change the material. We could change the wall thickness or change where the part is filled. Results from MoldFlow Express can also be exported to an e-drawing. Now you notice we have two shells in this model, one of three millimeters and another one millimeter. What we want to do is take a look at a different version of this part with a thicker wall thickness in order to see if we can optimize our part for the injection mold process. You see in this variation of the model, we have a wall thickness of 1.5 millimeters. So we've actually thickened the material. Now we've also, as we launch the MoldFlow Express Wizard, changed the injection location to more central to the part. So we took some of the feedback provided by the wizard and made those changes. Now, we've gone ahead and run the analysis in advance, but you see now, based on those changes, this part will fill with our given temperature and material and geometry. MoldFlow Express is outstanding because it lets us minimize material, which will minimize our costs, and also allows us to optimize our cycle time during the injection mold process. MoldFlow Express is a great example of how solid users can truly leverage the 3D model and extend the capabilities of design analysis throughout their enterprise.